I'm Amy Armstrong and we're here bringing you the brand new A-Wing XPS. We have literally put countless hours into this project over the last 18 months and it's been so fun. We realised we needed to bring in some fresh perspectives so we found who we believe to be the top wing designers on the planet right now and we gave them free range. We said join your understanding with ours, together let's see what we can do and we've pushed each other. It's been just an amazing process and we've got the somewhere that I think is really cool for free riding, freestyle, wave riding and we know you are going to love it. The new XPS wing design has been completely redeveloped from the ground up with our new design partners. And the exciting thing there was we just had an open slate. We were like, right, let's take everything we've learned, put it to a side and go somewhere new. And literally there was no end to the prototypes. Actually, I wish the prototypes ended a long time ago. But anyway, we said, no, we're gonna take the time, keep testing until we've got something we really feel has that X factor. Now the XPS stands for cross panel sail design. Now in the canopy, that means we've really got all the diagonal seams radiating from the load points in the center and the tips, distributes that load really evenly across the canopy and allows the warp and stretch of the fabric to align better with the loads, which is pretty standard sail design. So really we looked at what the sailing industry was doing and going, that makes a lot of sense. Let's work on that, implement it in the wings. And so that's really helped with maintaining the, the airfoil section and the profile across a massive wind range. So let's get into some of the details of exactly how and why this wing is so epic. So the development stage with the profile was really interesting and we wanted the profile to translate perfectly into the wing and that's meant a lot of work in the airframe and how the canopy attaches and the tensions. What this leads to though, more importantly, with the XPS cross panel sail design is a wing that is so balanced through a massive wind range. So it's got good bottom end, but you can just keep riding this wing until it's super lit and it's not gonna back wind, it's still gonna drive forward. Because the profile is translated so beautifully with the cross panel sail and the tensions in the airframe, when you sheet on with this wing and you want to go upwind, it just trucks upwind. Also we got a little bit of pre-twist going on in the tips. The pre-twist also helps the airframe when it's loaded up, load evenly across the whole span, okay? That's really important for delivering maximum juice from the area you've got. So construction, we tested a lot of materials, we tested Alula, we tested Hukipa, we tested everything we could get our hands on, but the test team consistently preferred the feel of more traditional Dacron construction. Now, it has a bit more flex, and especially up the wind range, it just allows the wing to breathe a bit more, and you actually get a bit more range out of the wing. So, we just decided we were gonna go with what felt best. And the DLE 160 is tried and true, tested material, probably the best Dacron to come out of over 20 years of kite development. So we're really happy with it. We have, however, reinforced it with UPE 200 and with modern lightweight Dacrons like we have here, the DLE 130, which just give you a really crisp connection to the airframe. But the main Dacron, it's got a really nice breathability. When you pump it, and when it's loaded, it helps distribute the load evenly and maintain your profile for the best feel. So all of the material construction details were about maintaining a really crisp, beautiful feel across the wind range. That was the driving factor in the decision-making process. Every choice we make is to deliver what we believe is the best combination of material suited for the purpose. We do that across the range, boards, foils, wings. We've got our curved strut, okay? Now, the reason this strut is curved 
is to set up the angle of attack so you're not having to sheet in all the time with your back hand, right? Your front wrist, this angle, this offset here, and the angle, the asymmetric front handle, allows your front wrist to be at a really comfortable ergonomic angle. Back arm doesn't have to be sheeted in too hard. You can session for hours. We've also got harness loop lines here, okay? You can add your harness string here if you want to hook in for endless hours on the water. Handles, yep, we've got our hybrid carbon handles. These things, we've got A stays and an internal carbon skeleton. That means they're super rigid, but still have give because they're connected via webbing to the strut. So they're the best of both worlds and they've got big radius with padding. You're not gonna ding yourself, you're not gonna ding your board on these things. I think they're the best handles out there right now. We've put a lot of time into those as well. On the front handle, literally, this wing vaporizes, right? It just floats. You're just gonna sit this thing there, ride the wave, really stable. You're not even gonna know it's there. You're gonna focus on your wave riding. You are gonna have so much fun on this wing, wave riding. This thing just floats so beautifully in your hand. Tacking, jiving, spinning, everything just sits right where it's supposed to be. Battens, okay. We've got these battens on the trailing edge. These things are, you can put them in or take them out. Lighter wind, you might want to consider taking them out, give yourself a bit more shape. Definitely, if there's wind, leave them in because zero flutter, a bit more crisp on the pump. Windows, okay. Yep, we use windows in our wings, okay. We like the windows. The windows mean, and we've extended the window range compared to our previous wing, so that when you're sheeted in and sailing, right, when you're sheeted in and sailing, you can see who's around you, which means there's no issue with having to depower and lift it up. Um, and this is the lightest TPU that we could find that does this job. These wings are super light. It doesn't add much weight because we've chosen the best TPU on the market. So the sizing for the XPS wing range. Compared to our previous wings, you probably want to size up one because they've got such good top end, right? Just to give you a bit more bottom end. So go up half to one size. Compared to most other wings on the market right now, it's the size to size is a pretty good comparison. The A-Wing XPS cross panel sail design wing range. We have done the best job we can. We've chosen the best materials we can to give the wing an amazing feel across the range. Hey, we've got a new wrist leash, new features, battens, all of that stuff, new handles. But the main thing is the feel, upwind, wave riding, freestyle, free ride. So crisp, so forgiving, so light. This is as good as we can do right now. I'm loving it. I hope you love it as much as me and put some big smiles on your faces. Get out there, have fun. See you on the water.